Hey guys, it's Nicola. So just for to this today's reading, I'll be doing it with the camera down. <laughs> Everything will return back to normal tomorrow. So and Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. This is for Tuesday, May the fifth, two thousand twenty. Okay. What guidance do we have for Gemini? All right, Gemini, we have Goddess of Oneness. It says someone you love is thinking fondly of you at the moment. Okay. Let's leave that there. Let's see what messages we have for Libra. All right, Libra, we have Goddess of Justice. It says what seems an injustice is actually a blessing. Okay. What messages do we have for Aquarius? All right, Chris, we have Goddess of the Unknown. It says a new chapter of your life is around the corner. Remove fear and embrace the unknown. All right, the underlying message. For all of my air signs, it's Angel of Healing. It says the angels have felt your sadness and have shown up today to send you healing. Chill out, kid. Leave them balloons alone. I'm sorry. <laughs> my mom bought me a bunch of balloons. I am still in recovery from my birthday weekend, guys, so... I do not, I do, my face is pale. <laughs> I'd rather y'all wait until tomorrow when I'm more vibrant before y'all see my face. <laughs> Let's see what messages, what guidance do we have. This is for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. We have for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. This is for Tuesday. May the 5th, 2020. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Ace of Pentacles under here. A new opportunity. Someone may have manifested a new opportunity here. Okay. So let's see here. We have the Seven of Swords here. I don't know if this is by some deceptive measures or someone's not being honest. Um... Eight of Pentacles here. So this could be about work or you investing into something that brings abundance for self. We got nine Pentacles here. So someone may be investing into a situation selfishly. Um, hermit here, Virgo energy here. Could also be in a space of thinking some things through. Ten of Wands here, feeling burdened. So there is some unstable thoughts here um, moving forward. Someone could be burdened, could be feeling oppressed. Hmm. Someone's doing a lot of contemplation about investing into something, but having some unstable thoughts, not feeling confident or sure enough of themselves. Okay, so why is this? How are we going to do this for the daily read? Let's just move this. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Can y'all see it? Okay. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Why is the Seven of Swords here? We have the Three of Swords. So someone may feel betrayed or there could be a clear betrayal here. Queen of Pentacles here. Someone could be having some unstable thoughts due to some sort of heartache, some sort of betrayal. Someone could be clearly heartbroken. With the Lover's card here, someone could be in a space of needing to make a decision. But having, again, unstable thoughts about making a decision or the decision that needs to be made. Alright, so... Two of Pentacles. Move that out the way too so you could just see that. Two of Pentacles here. Why is this two of Pentacles here? Alright. We got the Nine of Swords here. So someone is back and forth within their thoughts or within their foundation, having some anxiety around a transformation of either some plans or the transformation of a relationship. Um, Hermit card here. I feel like there's been a lot of thinking. A lot of worrying. Tower, Five of Pentacles, um, Hermit. So some of you guys, I feel like you need to let go of your worries. I feel like you need to concentrate on, I guess, moving forward. Alright, so we got the Hermit card here. That's about one within yourself. Discovering yourself. Why is this Five? Why is this Hermit card here? It's not the Five of nothing, y'all. Why is this Hermit card here? We have the lover's card here. So someone is in deep contemplation here, um, really inside of themselves, really trying to go inside of their feelings. I feel like all this is about a new opportunity. Someone is focused on either extending an olive branch, focused on an apology, or focused on moving forward. 
but someone feels like it's time to make a decision. Judgment, Page of Pentacles, Temperance. Someone feels like it's time to invest. So this is about investing into something moving forward. I feel like for some of you guys, you may not be confident about the investment. Ten of Wands here. Or someone's not confident about it. Ten of Wands, Ten of Cups. Someone's had the burdens of family or someone's dealing with, fam with familiar burdens like um, like family burdens situations um, with the six of wands here someone could be burdened by their pride dealing with a family situation five of swords someone could be making an unwise choice or could have made an unwise choice someone could have made an unwise choice that's why they feel burdened now whatever this choice was someone made an, un an unwise choice to move forward into something whatever this is that they've created is a burden I feel like they have an opportunity, Ace of Swords, Ace of Cups, Three of Cups, to move towards something else. But someone needs to lay down the burdens, um, remove the conflicts, and move toward their own victory or move toward whatever is bringing victory to, to them. So we have the Knight of Cups as the outcome. There could be an offer coming in. Um, usually the Knight comes with a message. The page usually has the messages. Um, but the knight brings them in. So with the two of swords here and the will of fortune, I feel like for a lot of you guys, the oppression that you feel of either making an offer or moving forward with something creates a stalemate. Queen of Cups here could now some of you guys you could be at a standstill because of some changes here. Um I feel like for some of you guys either you're needing to I don't know if you're acting off your emotions and that's creating a blockage, or someone needs to be in a space of bringing peace to their mind so that they can create changes that are nurturing for them. Ten of Wands here, High Priestess. Some of you guys know that a family situation or either a situation dealing with a mother here is a burden. Hangman here. I feel like your perspective has changed about something. So this is a dealing with some family situations. Someone could feel burdened. Um, couldn't know that it's in their best interest to move forward. But again, you may be lacking the confidence, having a little anxiety, unstable thoughts about moving forward like you just need to kind of like shake off your nerves all right so let's see what guidance we have what messages what guidance do we have for gemini libra and aquarius sun moon rising venus this is for tuesday may the 5th 2020 well this is moving forward this is for all right gemini we got freedom so some of you guys could be in a space of gaining your freedom okay hold on one second let me get my cat all right so let's see what messages we have for libra Libra, we have energy healing. So right now you need to be in a space of focusing on healing, especially if you moved out of something or changed some sort of family dynamics. I feel like there's a change in a family dynamic here. Aquarius, boy, it's too many. And look, we got let it go, mother, wife, sister, daughter, father, husband, brother, son, purification. So some of you guys could legit be going through like a divorce. What messages do we have for Aquarius? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. We got peace offering. So I feel like Aquarius right now, you just need to offer peace to the situation and all of my air signs. Allow yourself to be purified from whatever toxic, toxic <laughs> situations you've dealt with. This is all I have. Until next time, y'all.